Hi all, how are you doing? So uh, today I have come up with an idea of a DIY. It's a DIY. So what uh, I thought uh, I'll show you all. Actually, I was sitting and uh, I thought uh, I should do something different apart from painting canvas or t-shirts. So today I, uh, what I did, I had uh, one of my uh, sandals, which is like, uh, which is like kind of gone bad or it's very old so now I cannot wear it so this is the sandal you can see this is a sandal which is like here see you can see the leather is gone it, it is scrapped fox leather so I have uh, what I have done first the when idea came into my I, into my mind to change it so I thought uh, what I will do I will uh, change first one sandal to and then second one I'll do with you guys so this is the sandal which I converted so this is the old one and this is the new one you can see the difference and it's very easy you don't need lot of things you just need this lace see you can do it with any of your sandals you can change the color of the sandals like i thought i should do it in red color i wanted to do it so i did it in red color you can do it in multiple colors like multicolor lace also you can use you can use you can just paint it and use stones you can use pom-poms also you can use tassels also it, it's up to you how you want to uh, design it so this way i what i did i used this lace you can see this is a normal lace and i used these stones small stones if you want you can use different uh, stones also if you want if you don't want to use a stone it's okay that is also fine this stone i used you can see this stone i used and then i used this glue fabric glue you if you have a hot gun you can use hot gun also i use these fabric colors for changing the color like you can see this is copper color so i wanted to change the color if you don't want to change the color and you just want to apply some lace on that that will also work i'll show you in that way also in some another sandals so i changed the sandal uh, with the help of color and then i have stick the lace here and then the uh, then the stones so you can use this kind of lace also like you can see it's up to you if you want to make it a party wear then you can use this kind of lace so and you'll be needing brushes these brushes same brushes so let's start painting it i'll show you how i'm doing it so that if you want you can also do it this is the sandal which i'll be doing it so what i have done i have spread one cloth and i have kept my I have taken red color this is the red color you can take any other color any other brush size like I have the brush of size 10 you can see I have this broad brush flat brush it's better if you take a flat brush while coloring these kind of things so that it's easy for you to color. It covers a good area. So, yeah, and while coloring uh, this uh, sandals, what I'll do, I'll start from here. You can see these, this leather is gone. So, it will go very nicely on this. First, you need to do first coat. So 
so this way i have colored the upper part and now i'll be coloring whole lower part so first i will color here So now my sandal is all ready. I have done two coats and I feel it's quite good enough. So what we need to do now, take a lace, the lace which I am using, whichever lace you are using. Suppose you can see it's coming out. So I'll, I'll remove this part and I'll take the size of this. See, you have to take the size of end till end to end. You can see how good it is looking, right? And it will not look like you have changed it, you have done some DIY. So what I will do, I will just take the size of, I have taken the size and now I will cut it with the help of scissor. So this i have cut it so what i need to do so i am applying glue if you have a hot gun that is very that is also very nice thing i don't have a hot gun so i am using this glue i have to apply nicely on the lace it should not come out if it's coming out then you just need to apply glue above the lace also so that it sticks whenever you are wearing it always it's there so this way i have stick the glue we will be sticking it in the center so that the extra little bit extra what I have cut I will remove it once it dries out so I have stick at one place it will take some time to dry out so now I have this remaining lace what I am doing here again I have to take the size like I have a uh, option of doing it here or here I cannot uh, I was not I tried with this lace also but <clears throat> this lace was not covering the whole chapel so that's the reason I thought I'll do this way so what we'll do now I'll take the size of here till here you can see I have taken size till here till here you have to take it very carefully till the corner and like you can see it's coming out because it's not dried properly so I will cut the size here and same way I will be cutting another one as I have to stick both the sides I have cut two pieces you can see so I need to stick them now so this way I have taken out glue you have to apply a good amount of glue on the lace so that it should not it, it should stick properly it should not be like it it's come coming out
I'll stick it a little later. Once it is sticking this side, then I'll start sticking that side. So I have completed sticking all the lace. I'll be removing the extra and you can see some leather is coming out. So I need to use shoe fix for fixing it. So I'll insert this lace inside this so that it stays nicely. You can also use or if it's not going inside, then you can just stick it like that so that uh, that way also it will work. Nothing will happen. So now the turn is I have to use stones. I have to stick stones so these are the stones you can get any kind of stones if you want if you don't want stone it's fine you can use lace there are many ways you can use those satin uh, you can see uh, satin ribbons also right you can use them also to stick on your chappals and you can change them it looks that will also look nice so what I'll do I have taken this stone so from silver side what i will do i'll stick some glue on this and how i will start you can see i have a stick here in between the zigzag crosses so same way I'll do here. Same place I am sticking my stone. You have to do it very carefully because once it sticks it will not come out. So You have to leave it for drying for like one hour. After one hour if you use. So my sandals are all ready. They are all dried up. You can see they are looking so nice. It's a kind of party wear chappal and I can wear it and you must be having everyone must be having these kind of chappals. So they become old and I worn them a lot. Nothing happened to them. So I just wanted to make them look nice and so that i can use them i didn't want to throw them and it's better to reuse your old things like sandals they are really nice so if you like this idea of changing my old sandals into the new one please do like my video subscribe to my channel share comment